Number one reads the total change in the daily high temperatures from Monday to Saturday in one week in Columbus was negative 15 degrees Fahrenheit. Complete the table to show possible temperature changes for Tuesday and Thursday. So our goal here is to find the total change in daily temperatures. And we can see on the right side um, in this column that it shows us the change in daily temperatures for days from Monday through Saturday with Tuesday and Thursday to fill in. So when they say total over here, they're talking about the sum, so adding up all of the days. And we can see that all the days add up to negative 15. Now before we can figure out what Tuesday and Thursday are, we want to make sure that we're adding up the other days not including Tuesday and Thursday. So that's Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and Saturday. So when we do that, we're going to take 7 for Monday, positive 7, plus negative 12 for Wednesday, plus 2, positive 2, plus 1 for, um, for Friday and Saturday. And we want to add those up to see the total for the four days that we know. Now it makes sense first for us to go ahead and add our positive numbers together because those are kind of easy to add. 7 plus 2 gives us 9, plus 1 gives us 10, so we get 10 plus negative 12. Now on your own, try to total up 10 and negative 12. Remember that different signs you subtract and keep the sign of the larger number. Okay, so we found that 10 plus negative 12 gives us negative 2. So that means the totals from all days besides Tuesday and Thursday would just be negative 2. Now then we know that negative 2 plus the change for Tuesday and the change for Thursday all is going to total up to negative 15. So the change for the other four days and then Tuesday and Thursday together gives us negative 15. So what does that mean the total for Tuesday and Thursday are going to be? Think about what plus negative 2 gives us negative 15 and go ahead and try that on your own. So we see that negative 2 plus negative 13 gives us negative 15. And we can know that it's negative 13 because our number, our total, is lower than negative 2. So we know that we're going in the negative direction, 13, to get to negative 15. So what we just found is that the total from Tuesday to Thursday is negative 13. So Tuesday, the change for Tuesday, plus the change from Thursday, together will total negative 13. So now we need to think about some possibilities for changes in temperature for Tuesday and Thursday. So we want to think of some numbers that add together to give us negative 13. And there are plenty of different possibilities that we could use. A lot of times, I like to choose one of my values as zero because it makes it a little bit easier to find the total. For instance, if I make the change on Tuesday zero, which means the temperature didn't change at all, we can see that that would mean the change for Thursday would be negative 13. So one possibility that we could fill in for our table would be zero and negative 13 for Thursday. Now we can think of some other possibilities too. So maybe I decide to say that the change for Tuesday is, let's say, positive 1. On your own, try to figure out what plus positive 1 gives us negative 13. So you should have gotten that 1 plus negative 14 gives us negative 13. So that means that when Tuesday has a change of positive 1, that Thursday is going to change 
by negative 14. Now we could try one more of those together. Let's say the change for Tuesday is, let's say, negative 1 this time. What plus negative 1 equals negative 13? Well, we know that since we're already in the negatives, we have to add another negative to that to give us negative 13, and that's going to be plus negative 12. So another possibility could be that Tuesday has a change in temperature of negative 1 when Thursday has a change in temperature of negative 12. So these three possible answers would be good choices for this question, but there are many, many other choices that you can make. You just want to make sure that Tuesday plus Thursday equals negative 13.